Righty ho, I thought I'd try something a bit different. I thought I would try taking you guys for a little bit of a look around. Well, not a look around. I've just gone and got some pizza for dinner because we can't even bother cooking and we haven't been grocery shopping yet um, since we've been home. So we thought we'd go get some pizza for dinner and I thought, oh, I've been quite enjoying making these videos the last like, sorry about this, this is this little thing that's stuck in the way, I'll move that out of the way. I've been quite enjoying making these videos for the last like week and a half. So I thought, why not just continue making them and um, just bits and pieces of what I do with my life and my day and what we're doing at home and you guys seem to be enjoying them so I'll just keep doing them until you guys are fed up with me putting things on so I thought that this one here I will take oh dear lord these drivers you know when you're back at home especially where I live you always know because of the drivers now if anyone has been to Fakatani or from Fakatani or around the Bay of Plenty See if you know where I am, or see if you remember anything where I'm going. I'm now on a place called Peace Street. Peace? P? P Street? P Street? I think it's P Street. I don't, I don't even know the words of the where we are. My holder is not holding the phone very well. It's a bit too heavy. So, if anyone knows where we are, or oh, has been down here, let me know but yeah beautiful sunny day we have mowed lawns tied up tomatoes weeded the garden mum's done about four loads of washing sophie's just hung out in her room making tiktok videos oh look it's not really holding it is it it's not really holding it sorry guys i'm trying to do it for you but it's not really holding it so what i'm going to have to do Oh, well, I'll fix it in a minute because all the traffic's coming up. No, it's not going to hold the weight of the phone. I've got a new phone. And the phone I've got... I'll try to do it this way, see if I can. Right. So we've tried to fix the phone up and put the new... Uh, the new thing on a bit tighter so the phone I've got is a Samsung Note 10 or something and it's quite large and it's quite heavy so um the phone holder is not really designed for it but what are you doing now fella bay but we'll carry on so yes it's been a very as you can probably see in the video it's been a really really sunny day um, I think our temperature today was 20 21 or 22 degrees, no wind. And after being in Dunedin for, well, Dunedin, Cronwell and Queenstown for 11 days, this is beautiful. I must admit where our son lives, there's a lot to do. <clears throat> like there's a lot of restaurants, like you know, a lot of old buildings to go and look at. Um, there's museums, there's rock climbing, there's those trampoline parks um, in Cronwell, there's um, go-karting, you know, Queenstown's got all the water parks and everything. Gee, I'm sorry, just this woman that was behind me just took off like a nutter. Um, it's got so many attractions and so much food you can eat down there, like there's so much food to eat. Um, and where we live, we have nothing really. We have hot pools and a skate park. And yeah, we have takeaways, but every town has takeaways. But generally, compared to what Ryan has, we have nothing down here. But the one thing we do have is the warm weather. And I always thought, up until we went to, to the South Island, we were we were even, even me and mum were comp um, we're talking about, you know, maybe we should move to the South Island because that's where our, you know, our, our, our oldest son is and his partner and his parents and, you know, 
the family are there. So we thought, well, maybe we should move down there so we can be closer to him. We were considering it there for a while, but after being there and it was spring, we decided that no, 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 you know, there might not be a lot up here in the way of activities and things to do and the drivers up here are, how do you say it? How do you, how would you say it? Um, they're special. They're their own, they're their own breed, the drivers up here. Um, every town's got them, but our town seems to have a lot more of them. But, um, there might not be a lot to do, but it's the sun and the warmth. And I don't know about you guys, but when you get older, your body hurts more, your limbs hurt more, and sunshine seems to make it all better. Now, it may be, maybe that I'm just talking shit. I don't know. But also... I just let that car go. Um, but also... It may be a thing I don't know what do you guys think do you guys as you get older does the Sun sort of seem to help or does it just make you a bit more happier and a bit more settled and a bit more I don't know they say that sunshine um, is the key to happiness well one of the keys to happiness and when it's sunny you, your moods are in a you know you're in a better mood and I, I do agree I do agree that when it's when it's sunny you're in a better mood um, I'm sort of always in a foul mood, as my family would probably say, but I tend to love the sun. I didn't realise how much I loved it until I was away from it. And, I mean, even Ryan was saying that they've got beaches in Dunedin, and even in the middle of summer, you know, when it's 30 degrees, they, they get the odd day when it's 30 degrees and stuff like that. They still don't um, very, really swim. He said he has been for swims down there, but very rare. You know, and, and we've got a Hopi beach, and we've got the lakes around here we can go to. And, you know, we, I mean, we've got a pool we put up in summer, and, you know, Debbie and Sophie use that swimming pool every day, two or three times a day sometimes. So, you know, do you take, do you take all that away to go and move closer to family? This is, you know, it's, it's a bit of a dilemma when you get older and your children move home about you know the best things to do and you know what what there is to do what the best things to do are for your, your wife your kids your family and um believe it or not it's actually quite a responsibility because you've got to weigh everything up you can't just go oh you know um we should move to the south island because you know ryan's there and his partner's there and their family's there because it's not that easy because you've also got when well, my daughter goes to school here and we want to keep her in the same school you know well primary school with one school intermediate is another school and high school with another school but we want to keep her in that same area with her friends and the home that we've been in i mean we've been in the house what four four and a half years or something where we are now and that's her home so do we, do we want to take her out of that and for more from her friends we you know it's 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 the million dollar question so we don't know really, and you can't just go, oh, yep, you know, yeah, let's just move. It's not quite that simple, even if you have all the money in the world. You know, that's what I always say to people is money doesn't, you know, money doesn't make you happy. Yes, it makes things easier in life. But even if I had a million dollars right now, I still wouldn't know the best decision to do. But, but mum is pretty... Um, I think mum is pretty satisfied with um, staying here, and I think I am too. The weather, guys, it's the weather, eh? It's just, we were cold in Dunedin. We were really cold. Okay, this is the main highway, guys, to Tauranga, Rotorua. If you look to my left, you'll see Rotorua 81Ks, Tauranga 86Ks. But this is the main highway. This is how... I'm actually taking you guys, it might be a bit of a boring video for you, but I wanted to take you from the distance from town to our house. Believe it or not, it's only 8Ks, but it can take a lot longer when there's traffic, and it is, when it's Friday night at 5.20 in the afternoon. So there's a lot of traffic around for us at this time of day. Um, also, the city is cool, don't get me wrong, there's a lot of things to do in the city, but then also remember that when I come home, 
people would think you don't like mowing your lawns. I, I really enjoy my lawns, my grass, paddocks, gardens. And yes, they have those things in Dunedin too. I do understand that. But everything's just so cold. Like, it's just so cold. I mean, I, God forbid what winter would feel like down there. It'd be bloody horrific. I mean, maybe we should go in spring like we did. Go in summer one time and then go in winter another time to get all bearings. But I'll tell you one thing I want to do, if you watched, if you have watched my, all my videos um, I took when we were on holiday, you'll see a um, batch we were in in Cornwell, which is my wife's friend's place that she allows us to use for free. Um, she said we can use it any time we want, we've said, you know, how, what about a week over winter? And she's like, yeah, of course, just tell us what dates you want and we'll make it happen. So I'd love to go to Cornwall in winter, I really, really would. That would be the thing I'd love to do next. Uh, but we won't be able to go next winter because it's too close. Can you turn already, car? Jeez. Um, that car that just you saw turning is still turning now and it's just turned. For goodness sake. Um, what was I going to say? Um, because we won't be able to go next winter because it's too close to... Um, when we go down next, we're going down in October again next for our son's 21st. So I can't go in winter and again in spring. It's too close together, haven't got that much time off work, and I can't afford it, to be honest with you. Anyway, we'll turn that window up. We're nearly home, guys. So we're now on um, Thornton Road. So Matata is 8k away and Tarong is ahead of us. So this is the distance that we live out of town so some of you might think it's a long way. It's taken me what? How long has it taken us? 9-10 minutes? So not that bad, not really. I just thought I'd try a different video. I haven't tried a video like this of me just filming me going home and rambling on. So tell me if you guys want me, I'm going to upload this video tell me if you want me to make more like this or not so if you don't put anything in the comments I will just think that you like this and you or you don't like this so I probably won't make any more because you won't tell me so make sure you please put in the comments if you like these sort of videos of me just filming stuff like this and talking if you do I'll make plenty more if you don't I won't I just thought I'd try it it's something different it's something new and here we are guys at my house Alright, we'll just get these pizzas inside and eat. So let me know in the comments, guys, if you want me to make more of these videos or if you've had enough of them. Alrighty, thanks for coming along on the drive.